morning, this is Bob Mason from FX Empire and welcome to the daily crypto tech review of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin and Ripple's XRP. We'll be looking at the day's support, resistance and pivot levels, Fibonacci's and the EMAs. It is Monday the 20th of December. Looking at Bitcoin against the US dollar and the hourly candlesticks, it's been a mixed morning. Going to see Bitcoin move through the pivot at 47.175 to bring the first major resistance level 47.893 into play. Plenty of support will be needed for Bitcoin to break out from 47.500. So barring an extended rally, expect that first major resistance level. And resistance 48.500 to cap the upside. In the event of an extended rally, should see Bitcoin continue to target 50,000 levels before any pullback. Second major resistance level is at 49.081. Better to move back through the pivot will bring the first major support level of 45.987 into play. Barring an extended surf on the day, Bitcoin should avoid sub 45s. Second major support level of 45.269 should limit the downside. Looking at the EMAs, that's still a bearish signal. 50 pulling back marginally from the 100 and the 200 to look out for direction from the EMAs through the morning. So key would be to move back through the pivot at 47.175 and back through to 47.500 levels. Better to do that the support levels will be in play. Looking at Ethereum against US dollar, it's been a positive start to the day. In the Ethereum avoided fall back through the pivot 3951 to take a run at the first major resistance level at 4015. Plenty of support is going to be needed for Ethereum to return to 4000 levels, so barring an extended rally at first major resistance level and yesterday's high at 4039.73 should cap the upside. In the event of a breakout, should the Ethereum target 4200 levels before any pullback, second major resistance level is at 4104. Fall back through the pivot will bring the first major support level at 3861 into play, barring an extended sell off on the day, Ethereum should avoid the 23.6% FIB at 3738. Second major support level at 3797 should limit the downside. Looking at the EMAs, 50 and the 100 have converged, so that's indicating an imminent move. So look out for the direction there through the early part of the day. So key would be to move, avoid a fallback now through the pivot at 3951 and break back through to 4,000 levels to then target 4,200 levels. Better to do that and support levels will be in play. Litecoin against US dollar, it's been a mixed morning. Going to need to Litecoin at 4 to fall back through the pivot at 154 to take a run at the first major resistance level, sitting at 160. Plenty of support will be needed for Litecoin to break out from 155s. So barring then a rally that first major resistance level, and yesterday's high at 161.05 should cap the upside. The end of another breakout, but the second major resistance level 167 to cap the upside on the day. Fall through the pivot, bring the first major support level at 147 into play, barring an extended itself. Litecoin should continue to avoid sub 140s. Second major support level at 141 should limit the downside. Looking at the EMAs, 50 has continued to pull away from the 100 and closing in on the 200. So look out for a further narrowing on the 200 and a possible bullish cross that would support a breakout. The key would be to avoid a fallback through the pivot at 154 and break back through to 155 to bring resistance levels into play. Looking at Ripple's XRP against US dollar, particularly bullish start to the day. Going to see Ripple's XRP avoid a fall back through the first major resistance level, sitting at 8479, and break through the 23.6% FIB at 8533 to bring the second major resistance level at 8595 into play. Plenty of support from the broader market will be needed, however, to break out from that 23.6% FIB. So barring an extended rally throughout the day, that second major resistance level should cap the upside. In event of an extended breakout, Ritzy Ripple's XRP target 0.87 levels before any pullback. Fall back through the first major resistance level and through the pivot at 8342 would bring the first major support level at 8196 into play. Barring an extended sell off on the day, Ripple's XRP should avoid sub 0.8 levels. Second major support level at 8059 should limit the downside. Looking at the EMAs, 50 is pulling away from the 200 and the 100 with the 100 closing in on the 200. So look out for a bullish cross, 100 through the 200, that would bring 0.87 levels into play. So key would be to avoid fallback through the first major resistance level at 8.479 and break out from the 23.6% FIB at 8.533 to bring 0.87 levels into play.